So I'm going to be talking about wound care um, for hard to dress areas, such as the coccyx region. Um, so I'm going to be talking about triad from coloplast. And I do just want to say that I am in no way affiliated with coloplast and they are not sponsoring me for this video. Um, so what is triad? Triad is a hydrophilic wound dressing that offers a unique approach to wound management and wound treatment. Um, so it can be used just as the cream. Um, you don't need a cover dressing on it. Um, it is sterile, uh, but as soon as it is opened, it's no longer sterile. Uh, so you might want to use like a sterile um, cotton tip applicator while applying uh, just to keep it as sterile as possible. Um, it can be applied anywhere on the body and does adhere to wet skin. Uh, triad stays in place while other solutions may not. So for example, um, in the coccyx region where we get pressure sores, um, a lot of times we're using, say a, like an Aleven pad, it is waterproof, um, just so no urine or uh, feces gets uh, into it or the client can shower. Now with this, um, and you can uh, you can apply it and reapply it many times, um, which is a lot cheaper than reapplying these uh, multiple times a day. The Aleven pads are super expensive, um, and they can also cause pressure. So it has this pad in here, and it can cause a pressure sore itself um, in the coccyx region. So it's really nice with um, with this cream because you just apply it, and there's no added pressure. So how to use triad, um, you would clean the wound first uh, with some saline. So you would just clean it really good um, and, and gently wipe it away and clean it until all the cream is gone. Um, and then you would apply the triad cream just in a thin dime sized layer over top of the wound. Um, and no cover dressing is necessary. Now, if you did have a, a deep wound, you can put the triad cream on um, your packing to place inside the wound. So triad cream is great for pressure sores um, and hard irregular spots um, that are really hard to dress. Um, so your coccyx area, and it's really good for broken down skin. Um, when people have incontinence, um, you can use this cream. There's no bandage that's necessary on it. Um, it's also good for macerated peri wounds. So as you can see below, um, the skin is really macerated. That's caused by um, like drainage of the wound. It's it's just going all over the leg. So you can put the triad cream uh, in the peri wound. You can also put it on the wound. It will promote healing and heal up that leg really well. Um, it also removes uh, your sloughy material um, or your black eschgar. So why I love Triad? Um, I love Triad because I can teach families how to use this. Um, it's a lot easier for them than teaching them how to apply bandages and to um, get that, them to stay on properly. I can also have PSWs. If a client has PSWs already going into the home, it's very easy for them to apply this after their shower. Um, it reduces the cost of wound care. So supplies are super expensive. I mean, um, we wouldn't want to be changing these multiple times a day because in the coccyx regions, they seem to always like fold, lift up, um, poop gets in there. Um, it also reduces on nursing visits. So if I can have a PSW or family member apply this, um, it, it saves me from going out there. So it's it's saving, it's saving nursing visit money. Um, faster healing times. I find that the triad cream really heals up um, those areas really, really fast. Um, there's no added pressure to the wound because you're not putting a cover dressing on this. Um, although you can in certain certain areas if you need to. Um, and it's really easy uh, for those hard to dress areas. And it also cleans uh, the wound base really, really well and promotes healing uh, while it does that. So that's why I love Triad. All right, thanks guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I am going to put a link in the description of where you can get the uh, Triad Cream. Um, so if you just look in the description, there will be a link there that'll bring you right to uh, where you can buy this. 
Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe and I hope you enjoyed this video.